Hey everyone, in this video, I'll show you how to run x86 Ubuntu on an ARM-based Apple Silicon Mac using Parallels Desktop. We'll also break down what ARM and x86 actually mean and why emulation is a game changer. Let's dive in. Let's start with some quick context. So firstly, what is x86? So x86 is an architecture most traditional PCs and Linux distros run on. And what is ARM? ARM is Apple's M1, M2, M3 and M4 chips that are based on ARM based architecture. Now this architecture is super fast, power efficient and maybe that's why you are owning an Apple Silicon Mac but not natively compatible with x86 software. So how we can run a x86 architectured OS on an ARM based Apple Silicon Mac? So we can do that using emulation. So emulation is something that bridges the gap between both the architectures. Rosetta on Mac OS and now Rosetta for Linux translates x86 instructions into ARM in real time. It's slower than the native performance but it works remarkably well for most apps. So what you will need to get x86 Linux working on your Mac. All you need is of course your Mac and parallel desktop and a stable internet connection. So now let's see how we can install x86 Linux on Mac. So firstly let's go to parallels desktop. Now if you have not yet downloaded parallels desktop and want to know how to do that I'll link a video in the description you can follow that. So once you open parallels desktop you will see this add icon. So I'll click on this. So what it will do is it will open this window and this window as you can see has some operating systems that Parallels supports natively and you can install all these just by clicking on it. So today we are going to run x86 Linux. So to do that all I need to do is find this option that is download Ubuntu with Rosetta and click on it. So I'll click on it and I'll click on continue. Okay, now I'll click on download. Now it will take a few seconds to download the whole installer for Ubuntu 24.04. It might vary for you and give you the latest version. So once it is downloaded, now it will install Linux on your system. And just like that, it's ready to go. So I'll click on parallels and I'll have to set a new password. So I'll do that. And now Linux is up and running. Now what it will do is it will also install a few tools. These tools will help you get your camera and microphone from your main PC to be working on this x64 Ubuntu. So once all the tools are installed, it will ask for a restart. I'll do that. After reinstalling, I'll put my password. I'll click on next here. Again, next and again, next finish. And just like that, your Ubuntu is up and running. Let's see if we can access our internet on this. So I'll enter this and yeah seems like our internet is working fine and not only that you will also be able to access your camera and microphone from your main pc to this vm and just like that it's done now you can even install x86 applications on this vm test your application or use it as a ci runner or whatever you want to do with it so now there are a few limitations to this the first one is not all softwares will run flawlessly. There, there will be some performance issues in some of the applications, especially with the GUI apps. You might notice they might be a bit slower, but yes, the recent ARM based Mac chips are super powerful. So that won't be a lot of issue. Emulation will be CPU intensive, but you do not need to worry about that. And most of your applications and your VMs should run flawlessly. And that's it. You have now got x86 Ubuntu running on your M series Mac. Thanks to Rosetta for Linux and Parallels. It's not perfect, but it opens the door to a whole lot of legacy software and dev tools that aren't available on ARM just yet. If this video helped you, be sure to drop a like, subscribe and hit the bell notification so that you won't miss more Apple Silicon Linux tips. Drop your questions or experiences in the comments. I read them all. Thank you and I'll catch you in the next one.